Alright, here we're going to load the STL blade that we already uh, created into MakerBot and show you how to uh, orient it and size it and scale it and all of that. So to start with, we're going to add it. And I find it right here. This is where I saved it. I'm going to go ahead and say move to platform. Click on it to highlight it. And the first thing we'll do is go ahead and scale it up. Maximum size. Close that. Now we want to orient it in such a way that it's going to print uh, easily. And ideally we would like to be able to, to line up maybe four blades uh, wide here. So let's go ahead and go to turn. Click again to show up this uh, numeric panel. And let's see, I believe this one. And like that. And let's go ahead and twist it like that. And I believe that. Let's go ahead and scroll around and uh, make sure that, yeah. So that's the orientation we're looking Oh, wait a minute, no. Uh, we want this curved edge to be pa facing down. So let's go ahead and suck that, and there we go. Now, uh, we want it to be down on the floor, so go to Move and on to Platform. And normally, let me move around so you can see this. If we were doing multiple blades, what we could do is line them up in a row here so that we could print out an entire set all at once. However, the other thing we want to do is we want this to be the full length of this area. So we're going to go to, go to scale, double click to bring it up, and maximum size again, and go to move on platform. There we go. So that is pr now properly set up so it's the largest blade we can print. We can put multiple in a, in, in a row on the width here. And from there you would go to make and you want to use a raft and a support. The raft will lay down a, a, a layer, disposable layer, on the printer plate and then the support will create a scaffold under this uh, lip because the blades sticking out in uh, midair. Let's go ahead and cancel that. The blade sticking out in midair as you can see and the support scaffold will be under there and allow it to print it and it'll just be uh, you can peel it away. So that's pretty much the process. You would go into here and if this were connected to the printer right now, we just say make now and print. So that's, uh, that's pretty much it. Happy modeling and uh, printing. <laughs>